Well, all right, guys. Is your old NES console having that dreaded blinking red light of death like mine is right now? Don't need to toss it away. Let me show you how to fix it. Alrighty guys, using a Phillips head screwdriver, you're gonna remove one, two, three, four, five, six screws. And the top should come off pretty easily there. Don't forget to remove any game cartridges that you may have inside. Now, you're gonna remove one, two, three, four, five, six, seven screws. Now you have to remove one, two, three, four, five, six screws. And there's two longer screws, so remember the position, those two silver ones. Now carefully remove the tray towards you. Remember, these are all fragile components, so just be very careful. Remove one and two screws. Now you just wanna do is lift up the motherboard just a bit. Don't have to lift it up all the way. And then little by little, wiggle from the side to side of the 72 pin connector. And it should come out. Now I got this connector off Amazon. It was $12, relatively cheap. I uh, highly recommend it. Gave me no issues, nice and clean. All right, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, it was a bit snug, so you just gotta go little by little, just pushing it from the left and the right consistently, and it got in there. Now all you wanna do is just follow the video in reverse, and everything should go back smoothly. Now the only thing I recommend is that you test the tray, make sure it's going up and down smoothly. At this point, you can also go ahead and put a video game into the console and actually test it out before you actually close it up all the way. But I'm pretty positive it's gonna be okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and just close it up and we're gonna go test it. As it is a new pin connector, it's gonna be a little snug putting the games inside, but after a while, It'll come in and out easily. Turn it on. No f flashing red light and success. Appreciate the watch. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions, feel free to put them down in the comments. Thank you guys. Have a good one. See you in the next one.